All right, class, good morning. We are recording uh, our screen here this morning so we can see where we have to go to find um, today's assignment for social studies. First, you're going to go to your Clever account. So go ahead and click on your Clever account. And then after you do that, let me give me some ads here, sorry. After you do your Clever account, you want to go down here to where it says TCI subscription. And you're going to click on your TCI subscription in your Clever account. And then, boom, that's the picture of our social studies book. So yesterday you were working on your map, and if you didn't stop my screen and you need to see it, you could find that right here in your book. Now, mine's a little bit different. I'm going to click on Teach Now to get to where you guys are. And then you should have a list of all the different um, units so far. When we're on Unit 5 down here, the population density of the North East. If you'd like to see the book, you click over here. I'm going to go to the opportunity for us to play our game. All right. So we're going to go to the place where it says Lesson Game here on the left toolbar. When you click on that, you're going to have this little game that looks a lot like mine. Answer the question to reveal a picture, then use the picture to answer the final question. So we got to get these right to be able to get the pictures. What is the measure of people living in an area called a megalopolis unit? Miles, people per mile, population density, or square mile ratio? I don't remember hearing any of those in our book except for C, population density, which I'm sure is going to be on my test. Let's see if I got it correct. Correct. I've earned one point. So when I close that, now I started to, I already know what this is a picture of. We saw this picture a bunch. I'm going to get one in the middle. A doctor would most likely work in a blank. Think first, doctors work in where? In a large city, in a small town. A rural area in a farm town. Now, farm town, rural area, and small town are all the same thing. And you don't have a lot of doctors out there. You may have a small clinic, but a doctor would probably live in a large city. In fact, many, many people come to the city of Milwaukee because we have such great doctors at Children's Hospital. Let's see if I did it. Correct. Earned one point. Boy, you probably already have a great idea of what this picture is. Once you've completed all 12 of those and you've got them correct, then you'll get your final question. All right? Now, guys, some of you guys have been doing a great job on this. I haven't been giving a ton of points to this. This time I'm going to give it for half of a test score. So make sure that when you're done uh, with it, you've done all 12 of them and you got them correct. Now, if you get one wrong, it's no big deal. You can always do it again. So let's just say I did this one wrong. Oh, incorrect. Please try again. All right, so I'm going to try it again. Close that one. Try again, okay? They already showed me which one I did not do right. So you could guess and guess and guess, but when you get it right now, what is a megalopolis, a large city where lots of shops and business are, a small town, a string of cities. There it is. I got to correct. Notice I only get half the points, half the points. If I get them all right, I should have 12 points. Now for an A+, plus, you need 10. It means you can only get two wrong, okay? So take your time. Look up the answers if you need to. Now, when you're done, you can go to this place for the vocabulary cards. And this is what you should work on. We only had three of them. And Megalopolis is what? A great city consisting of a string of towns. Now, if I had done the cards first, it would have been easy for me to get some of those right on the, the little game. A substance that makes the air, water, soil, dirt, or uns dirty or unsafe to use. What is that? That's pollution. Any substance that makes air, water, or soil dirty or unsafe to use. Next card. It's the only three cards. Population density, a measure of the average number of people living in a unit area. Now, these are the first three questions on your test tomorrow, so hopefully you've studied enough tonight. All right, review in your book. Enjoy the game. Answer the final question. Why don't you, when you're done, go on to Go Guardian and text me how many points you got so that I can write it down. Otherwise, I can come into the screen and check it out later on. You guys have a great day. Study hard.